the popular, low-Earth orbit satellite communications company, OneWeb, which is backed by the Barty Group, confirmed on Saturday that it had successfully launched 36 satellites by Arian Space from the Vostokny Cosmodrome. This launch brings OneWeb closer to completing its ambition of 5 to 50 and the start of commercial service by the end of 2021. With this successful launch, the total number of OneWeb's in-orbit constellations now stands at 218 satellites. All of them will combine to form a part of OneWeb's 648 LEO satellite fleet that will aim to provide high-speed, low-latency global connectivity. As of now, there is one launch left until the company has the satellites that it needs to enable its connectivity solution to reach all regions that are north of 50 degrees latitude by June of 2021. What do we know about the launch? The liftoff, which is one of the many recent ones to have taken place, occurred on May 28. This launch also plays a key role for the company, as it represents the fourth of five planned launch programs meant to fulfill the 5 to 50 service that will enable OneWeb to offer connectivity across the UK, Alaska, Northern Europe, Canada, Greenland and the Arctic Seas. The service is expected to be switched on before the end of 2021, with the aim of making it globally available in 2022. The satellites are built by OneWeb Satellites, a company that is a joint venture between OneWeb and Airbus, located on Merritt Island, Florida. The company is capable of producing two satellites each day. Due to this advanced capability, the company is able to rapidly and reliably build its first-generation fleet, meant to be in orbit by mid-2022.